Say a woman used a dating website to lure a man to a deadly robbery. These are the two women and two men police arrested. The victim's brother also shot and channeled to his car, Willis, live at DeKalb Police Headquarters, where he talked to a detective late this afternoon. Well, we talked to her just a little over an hour ago, and she believes they have all the suspects involved in this case. Still, she warns the public about dating websites and apps like these. DeKalb County Police say they have four people in jail for the murder of 23-year-old Jordan Collins. Well, this should make people feel safe, but need to be careful what, what websites you go to and who you're asking to come into your house. That's because police say Collins was killed and his brother shot after being lured out of the house by 21-year-old Nashia Poole and 24-year-old Clarissa McGee, women that they met on the dating site and app Plenty of Fish. They said they wanted to go outside and look at their dog. The women were able to get Jordan to go outside. That's where police say 25-year-old Antonio Avery and 27-year-old DeMarco Butler were waiting for him. He was shot and killed. The three children he was babysitting inside were unharmed, but his brother Chad was shot when he went to check on him. He heard the shooting and they, they kind of a chase inside into the house, and then and then one of the female suspects fled outside. But arrest warrants show that police were able to search cell phone records, and that led to the identities of the women. It doesn't appear that anything was taken. But you do believe robbery was the motive? Yes, sir. Now, police have all four suspects. They're charged with murder and aggravated assault, but police have not said which of the four suspects they believe pulled the trigger. Portland, Lavender, Cap County, Carl Willis, Channel 2 Action News.